Hey, what's up, everybody? It's your boy Willie V, aka Boo Boy Kennels. In this tutorial, we will be going over on how to convert picture clippings. And what I mean by picture clippings are .pict clipping images, which you'll usually get from from your iTunes library if you ever copy over your images. So what we're going to go ahead and do is we're going to go ahead and uh, open up iTunes. And here I have some of my albums with their album covers. Now, I may want to copy this image, so we'll go to Get Info. I'll click on the image, and I'll drag it over to my desktop. Now, if I get info on that, we'll see that this file ex extension says Picture Clipping. Now, many programs won't open up this file. For example, uh, Photoshop. It doesn't recognize these uh, file types so me we, we may want to convert this to either a TIFF, PNG, GIF, JPEG something with a different extension that is more workable with a vast majority of applications so I'm going to show you two ways on how we can convert this particular image the first of which would be using preview now, we can go ahead and uh, go to this image and do a Command C as a shortcut to copy it. So now I have that image copied. Now, the image itself, when you go to right click on it and you go open with, there's really not anything to really open that image with. So let's go ahead and uh, go to preview. Now, in preview, we can do open. And as you can see, we cannot open that picture clipping file, which is why we did Control C to copy it. And let me just uh, close that out. So we can go to preview, and since I've already copied it to my clipboard from iTunes, we can go to File, New from Clipboard, and now it pastes in the image that was actually used for my particular album. Now the image size may differ, may be smaller, may be larger, but usually if you're using the images or the cover art that's used in iTunes, you'll get a very great high quality image. Now I can go ahead and take this and then save it to whatever format that I want, even a PICT format, which is basically the same thing as, a, as the picture clipping, but without the clipping at the end of it. Now I usually like to save them as a TIFF if I'm going to use it for something else or I can save it for Photoshop or whatever have you. So that's that's the one way to do it using um, preview as an option to be able to do that. Now the other way and this is a program that I've talked about in the past is graphic converter. Now what I like about graphic graphic converter is not only can you convert the image but you're also able to do a lot of different edits to the images as well and also do batch converting so if you have a bunch of those type of images that are from iTunes or just that particular extension then graphic converter is a good application to be able to go ahead and uh, do um, batch exports so let's go ahead and uh, open up this image and now we have it opened up with graphic converter. Now you see it shows a larger size for the image, but again, we can still go to File, Save As, and then pick the format that we want to save. And then that way we can save that particular image. So we'll just say that I want to save it as a TIFF file. Now I get a nice high quality file. And go ahead and uh, with the graphic converter, we can go ahead and shut that off. Now I have my TIFF image. And there we have it. So those are two simple ways to be able to use either preview, which you don't have to install anything because it already comes on your Mac, or graphic converter, which can also convert those 
picture clipping images as well and also do batch converting also. Now if you want to know where you can per purchase that program it's not you can you can use it freely for as long as you want but you can also um, purchase it and that is from lemkesoft.com I'll go ahead and uh, include the link to their site in the notes and like I said you can use it freely for as long as you want until you plan on um, purchasing the program itself anyways this was uh, Willie V aka Bull Boy Kennels of iTexture.com and as always thank you for taking the time to watch.